I am truly appreciative, honored, and humbled for being selected to win this so meaningful award. I'd like to thank Justice for All, the Association, the Foundation, and the lawyers who nominated me for this award. I'd also like to thank the wonderful firms at which I've worked, Tucker Ellis, Benezzi, Switzer, Polito and & Hupp, and currently Janik LLP for three things. Number one, for being in exceptional places to practice law. Number two, for not only allowing but encouraging pro bono work and volunteerism. And number three, for having an unbashful and dedicated eye towards diversity and inclusion. I'd also like to thank my family, my friends, and my fraternity for keeping me grounded and encouraged and also for reminding me that time spent volunteering and encouraging others is never time wasted. What does volunteering mean to me? You know, volunteering is synonymous with the word feeding to me. And when I say feeding, I don't necessarily mean food or drink. I mean feeding experiences, feeding your wisdom, feeding encouragement, feeding individuals the ropes. Through the Lewis Stokes Scholars Program, we strive to feed the scholars an internship in a real world legal settings, whether that's in a corporation, a firm, a court, or a legal aid society. But importantly, we also try to feed the scholars other meals, whether that's facts about Cleveland, the arts, etiquette, or emotional intelligence, so that they're not only intelligent individuals, but they become the well-rounded people that we want to work around. Brandon Brown, who had the pleasure of co-mentoring his first year as a Stokes Scholar, is now the chairperson of the Lewis Stokes Scholars Program. He is also a practicing attorney at Calfee. We have four Stokes Scholars alum who sit on our committee and are so eager and willing to share their talents, their time, and their treasures to feed other Stokes Scholars. I know I've discussed how important it is to feed others and how we also need to be fed, but I have a personal example of what the Stokes Scholars means to me and the type of individuals that we have in this program. In 2016, during an interview with a young man by the name of Dante Gresham, I received a phone call in which I learned my father's life would change forever. I had to leave the interview and rush to University Hospital to attend to my father. After a long day of being in the hospital and my mind going in many different places, I decided I needed to go back to my office before going home to my young son and family just to make sure that I got myself together. Well, when I arrived to my desk, my office, there was a card on my desk, this card right here, and it was from Dante Gresham, the young man from the interview, which I had to leave early. And in the card, Dante writes, a nice personal message and the first thing he writes is feel better soon and stay encouraged. That's the type of individual that we have in the Stokes Scholars Program. We want to encourage, we want to feed, we want to build and I'm so thankful to be part of this program. We have a fantastic committee but it is you, the legal community, that we must thank. It is you who are bringing in the Stokes Scholars, who are mentoring the scholars, sharing your experiences, your passions, your interests and that are hiring the scholars once they graduate. I thank you for that. And as for me, <laughs> I know we've talked a lot about feeding and being fed. Thank you for this award. I am so truly humbled. This is the best main course that I could ever imagine, and I am so exquisitely full. Thank you.